All right, so it's Sunday morning, 8.50 in the morning. I just had some breakfast, so it was really good. Now we gotta clean up. Church starts at nine. I have to walk about eight minutes up to put my suitcase in the car, then, then walk back eight minutes. So I might miss beginning the church. It's kind of like a rush, rush, rush. We all have to be out of here by 9 a.m. So yeah. It's about 9.15 a.m. right now. I just parked my car about eight minutes up that way. But now I have to go back and walk this way another eight more minutes because for church service starts at 9.30. So I start at 9 a.m., but it's 9.30, so at least I'll make it to church service. The love of God is greater far Alright guys, it's 10.45 a.m. Um, church was a little bit shorter today. I, mean, I think they were kind of in a rush to get out of there. They had to get out of there at a certain time. Um, but but um, my sister, the kids, they're all going to go to this store called Ikea um, to get some like fruits. And I think Matthew wants to get some pie. So I might just like go there and see what they get. <laughs> All right, so I'm at Akita. I don't see my sister's car here, so I don't know if she's here yet, or maybe um, she's not here, I'm not sure. But the line is really long. I'm not sure what the line, I don't know if it's the line for the food or the store. There's a store and a food. Um, and I'm gonna stop because of parking. So I'm gonna at least use the restroom here. <laughs> All right, I did get a couple of items. I didn't see my sister. I texted her. I'm trying to figure out if she's coming or maybe she's not coming. But um, this is a pretty famous place. They also have like a place to get food like burgers and stuff. Um, they're famous for their pies. I think they sell chicken pot pies and stuff like that. But um, I got something. I just, you know, I wanted something healthier options. <laughs> so this looks really good with a chicken cutlet. This was $5.67 really big i might make that tonight or tomorrow night i also decided to get a pork cutlet just try something different <laughs> um this is 4.98 and they had they're, they're also famous for their dip they have a lot of dips i got a veggie dip that looks really good this is 5.99 and the chips were 4.59 so these chips are sea salt rice chips that'd be kind of healthy <laughs> So yeah, let's go ahead and try some chips and dip and see how it tastes. Let's do that. Let's just see how it tastes. It's good. It's rich though. Mm. I wanted a snack. 
before I go to Raisin Cane's. I was kind of hungry. Also, this dip is a little salty. <laughs> yeah, I like it. All right, so I texted my sister. Um, she didn't know I was coming and she decided not to come because well, I guess it was, she thought it was a lot closer on the way. It's more 30 minutes out. So I was able to go there. <laughs> I want to be home late tonight, guys. Probably probably 5 p.m. I'm, right now, I'm, I'm at Raising Cane's. So I'm going to do a mukbang video. Um, and I do want to eat. I'm a little hungry. Um, but yeah, I'll be, able to, I'll be home a little bit later tonight. All right, guys. We went to Raising Cane's today. I got some... Well, basically, there's three chicken tenders in here. There's three chicken tenders. We have the cane sauce, like the garlic toast, and the crinkly fries. Looks really good. Also comes with a Dr. Pepper or any drink of your choice. Mm. Um, this is about $10 for a combo. You can get four chicken um, strips, but it comes with coleslaw. I don't like coleslaw, so. I got um, extra sauce because I think it's, I like to dip it the sauce in the garlic toast, the chicken um, strips, and the fries. So let's get started. Let's try it out. Mmm. Mm -hmm. It's very good. I forgot to ask for ketchup. <laughs> like this one's kind of small, but whatever. Mm. Mm. All right, guys, I just finished raising cane, so it's pretty good. I did my video. It's almost 3 p.m. It will take me another two hours to get home, so hopefully I can go straight home without taking any breaks. I can just go and be home by 5. That would be great. All right, guys, just an update. I came home around 5 p.m. I left at 10.45 a.m., so it took me like 11 to 5. It took me like almost six hours to come home. Crazy. It was... It's crazy because it was only supposed to take me like three and a half hours to get there and get back. <laughs> there wasn't really actually a lot of traffic actually, but um, I went, so I went to this, um, I forgot the store's name. I think it's, so I went to the store called Ikeda, I-K-E-D-A, where they sell like a lot of like fresh dips. You know, vegetables, pies, salsa, chips, all, you know, homemade food, like that type of stuff, like a little store. Um, and I thought my sister was going to come. And she she didn't because, and she didn't know I was going to come, so it's, it's fine. But it was three minutes out, and so that was probably an hour, that's probably an hour of wasted time. But it's fine. I, I, you know, I got some really good chips and salsa or chips and dip, and I got some good meats, so... Um, and maybe it was good for the vlog. Apparently it's really popular and famous. So if you guys have ever been there that live in California, especially in Northern California, let me know. But yeah, just an update. It was a pretty good trip. I would probably go back. I kind of did enjoy it and enjoying spending time with family. That's really nice. I don't really do that a lot. And it's just hard with my Walmart schedule now. It's just hard to take time off. It really is. So, um, but yeah, it was very beautiful there. My sister would definitely go back. I think she really enjoyed it. And uh, it was funny, I talked to her about, like, she was saying, I have no energy. Like, she's like, I have very little energy. But when I go take vacations, my energy goes way up. I'm like, yeah. Even my nephew, when he came the first day, he was really hyper. Like, what the heck? And I feel the same way. You know, when you go on a vacation, maybe it gets your mind's clear and you're just in a relaxation mode. Your energy goes way up. So, that was cool. So, I did Raising Canes for a mukbang video. Um, it was pretty good. I I've just, but I do feel like next time, maybe something different. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's, maybe it's getting old for me. Um, but we'll see how I feel tomorrow. Um, if I, if I really want it or I'm craving it. But I, I feel like I wanted something else. But I don't know. But it was a fun video to do. And I, this is my third Raising Cane's video I've done. So that's good. So today might be, so this video might be a short vlog because I didn't really do much. I did a lot, a lot of driving, a lot. I came home and I took an hour nap and I'm rested. Now I'm going to work on editing. I already edited the first, I'm making this three parts. I already did the first day. So tonight I'm going to start the second day and um, maybe Wednesday 
um, I have a Ricky client on Wednesday. I won't be doing much editing on Wednesday, but um, but th that's the third day, which won't be very long vlog, I don't think. But yeah, it's 8 p.m. right now. I'm not super hungry because I just had raising canes a few hours ago, so I'm just gonna have some chips and dip, you know, and some coffee. <laughs> in this work on my editing in my second my second vlog day two so that's what I'm doing today and I'll start tomorrow to start back with my weekly vlogs this vlog um in three parts um I thought I had a lot of fun and I guess I'll guys see you next week for my weekly vlogs peace